You can add weld beads to an assembly as a feature. Here I have a tank assembly, and I want to weld it together. I've already created a couple of chamfer cuts in a previous lesson, so let's take a look at how to add a weld bead feature to seal the gap. Since this is now an assembly feature, it can also be found on the Assembly Feature drop-down menu, as well as on the Weldman's Toolbar, or from the Insert drop-down menu. With the Weld Bead Property Manager open, there are two different methods for selecting the faces to weld. You can use the Smart Weld Selection tool by pressing the button, and click and dragging to indicate the weld path. As I do this, you can see the faces highlight and are added to the weld selection box. Alternatively, you can simply highlight the weld selection box and graphically select the faces. Now, all I have to do is set the radius for the bead size. With the path and radius defined, I'll now define the weld symbol. I'll click the button and a pop-up window appears. Here I can define the weld symbol and any other annotations I'd like to add. I'll click OK to accept the changes and close the window. I'll leave the rest of the properties at the defaults and click the green check to finish the Weld Bead feature. Notice in the Feature Manager there is now a folder called Weld. If I expand this folder, you can see a Weld subfolder, and within that is our Weld Bead feature. 